House Lannister and the Power of Women It wasn't until recently that a woman could hold a position of power. Now, it is common to see women with high-class jobs, easily intimidating the people below them. However, the way they use it differs from woman to woman. Power can be abused, regardless of gender, and such abuse can result in a completely different turnout than expected. Some of the best examples of powerful women actually come from famous literature. One of the best examples would be Cersei Lannister from Game of Thrones by George R. R. Martin. In the beginning, Cersei is strong-minded, manipulative, and merciless. By the end of the book, Cersei has lost a large portion of the power she once held over the kingdom, relinquishing her power over to the king's hand. How could such a strong, powerful woman make a 180 degree turn so quickly? A queen, a mother, and the only daughter of one of the most powerful houses in the Seven Kingdoms, Cersei is well known yet unquestionably despised by all. Brought to power by marrying King Robert Baratheon, Cersei is manipulative and cruel, using her position maliciously. House Lannister has always been one of immense size and mighty strength making it the most intimidating house in the Seven Kingdoms. As the only daughter of Tywin Lannister, and as the most powerful woman in the kingdoms, Cersei Lannister abuses her power. Had she been less power-hungry, the story may have ended differently. But this is not the case. Cersei is driven by the need to protect her young, because the Seven Kingdoms is not a safe place for children, especially when commoners are constantly plotting to remove the future heirs permanently. Cersei does what she wants, abusing the power given to her. She murders the king, has affairs, manipulates everyone lower than her, and listens to no one but her twin brother. Most women are described as manipulative and at times ignorant, but rarely do such traits cause a completely different turnout than in Game of Thrones. By the end of the book, Cersei has started to unravel, and her normal clear-headedness, manipulative personality becomes unsteady. She slips up and makes mistakes that changes the outcome of the story. By killing the king and putting her son on the throne, she has made her immature eldest child extremely vulnerable. In an attempt to make her child safe, she has instead put him in a position of weakness. Cersei was too wrapped up in what she could do with her power that she didn't think of the consequences. Such a mistake supports the fact that people get power hungry and, in result, Things that were supposed to end perfectly, end unfavorably.